Hey guys, I am so excited for the release of my first cytology course, Mastering Cytology, Skin and Subcutis. And if you are wondering what this course entails or what you might get out of it if you decide to invest in it, I wanted to give you some more information about that here. So this is a five hour race approved, completely at your own pace, lifetime access course where we're gonna go over fine needle aspirate cytology of mass like lesions in the skin and subcutaneous layers. And this is something that you can access as many times as you want at any time of the day. As long as you have internet access, it's completely at your own schedule, which I know is important because you guys are busy. Um, I know I need flexibility in my CE. You know, it's important to just be able to do these things when you have time. So that was something that I wanted to uh, emphasize in this course that you can get to it any time, day or night. If you're up at three in the morning, just dying to know more about mast cell tumor cytology, then you can access it then, whenever. Um, this is webinar based. So one thing about me is I'm a very visual learner and I just don't do well with a bunch of words on a PowerPoint slide. Um, so my course is filled with lots of pictures because that's how I learn best. And we are gonna talk about concepts from inflammatory lesions to neoplasia, um, how do I know if something's cancer or not? When is it better to just go forward with histopath to get a diagnosis? Where are the limitations of cytology? What do I even do from the get-go? What, what am I even looking at? How do you uh, organize your thought process when you put the, the slide up on the microscope? Where do you even start? Because I know that that can be really frustrating sometimes, especially when you're getting comfortable with cytology. So at the end of the course, we actually have a whole module where you can see straight through my microscope um, and we go through cases where I will go through my thought process and um, explain how you get to the diagnosis in those cases. So that's pretty cool. Um, what I hope for you at the end of this course is that you not only feel more comfortable with cytology and you feel like you want to get in there and dust off your scope and get to work and, and look at things in practice, but I also hope that you actually start to enjoy it um, because I, I love what I do. I, I really do, I love cytology. Um, it, I wouldn't do it every day if I didn't like it. And one thing that I love even more is seeing other people start to enjoy it and understand it. So that is why I created this course um, and what I hope for you to get out of it at the end of it. And if you have any questions at all about what this is or need any more information, please feel free to reach out to me by email and we'll get those answered for you. But otherwise, I hope to see you in the course.